How many great graduate transfers have there actually been? Russell Wilson went to Wisconsin and was insanely successful, took them to the Rose Bowl when he left NC State because Mike Glennon was behind him. Jake Ruddock, Rudock, I mean, that's pretty low on the list. Other than Russell Wilson, almost all of these guys are incredibly hyped. And then the actual result ends up not being that substantial. Now, maybe Joe Burrow down at, uh, down at LSU is going to be a difference maker most of the time. In 90% of the time that I have seen, graduate transfers have not actually panned out in a way that you would anticipate. There's a lot more talk about them than there is actual results. The best example of this, remember Jeremiah Masoli who transferred to Ole Miss and everybody was like, oh my God, this guy's going to be unbelievable. And then he didn't pan out at all. And look, there's a difference between a guy transferring and a guy being a grad transfer. If you transfer and you sit out for a couple of years, there's a lot of examples of guys that made a lot of sense. Troy Aikman transferred from Oklahoma to UCLA and was infinitely more successful. But almost all the time, the grad school quarterback transfer is not actually that good. In other words, you don't win a conference championship. You don't make the team to take the team to a different level. The only guy that I can really think of so far is, again, Uh, Malik Zaire is another good example. Everybody's like, oh, Florida got Malik Zaire, and then he wasn't any good. Uh, The only guy I can really think of is Russell Wilson. Almost all the time, grad transfer doesn't pan out. Now, there's guys who get kicked out of school, Cam Newton style, go off to Blinn, I think it was, junior college, then come back to Auburn. That's different. There are guys that have panned out and been successful that way. But grad transfer, I'm going somewhere for only one year. Uh, There's not a lot of great success stories there. Or guy, look, if you go for two years or more, I think it's a little bit different, which is why I said from the get-go, if I were Jalen Hurts, I would have made that move.